Vincent Remigius Fisher, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Almighty God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ has freed you from sin, given you new birth by water and the Holy Spirit, and joined you to his people. He now anoints you with the chrism of salvation so that you may remain members of Christ, priest, prophet, and king, unto eternal life. Isaiah James and Vincent Remigius Fisher, you have become a new creation and have clothed yourself in Christ. May this white garment be a sign to you of your Christian dignity. With your family and friends to help you by word and example, bring it unstained into eternal life. God, Father, open it up, please. Take the candle out. Receive the light of Christ. Parents and godparents, this light is entrusted to you to be kept burning brightly so that your children, enlightened by Christ, may walk always as children of the light and persevering in the faith, may run to meet the Lord when he comes with all the saints in the heavenly court. May the Lord Jesus, who made the deaf to hear and the mute to speak, grant that you may soon receive his word with your ears and profess the faith with your lips to the glory and praise of God the Father. Amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. You have been baptized in Jesus Christ. Now you are clothed with Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Dear brothers and sisters, these children, reborn through baptism, are now called children of God, for so indeed they are. Through confirmation, they will receive the fullness of the Holy Spirit, and approaching the altar of the Lord, they will share at the table of his sacrifice, and will call upon God as Father in the midst of the church, now in their name and in the spirit of adoption as sons and daughters, which we have all received, let us pray as Jesus taught us. Our Father, Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. The Lord God Almighty, through